everyone and welcome to a question and answers Islam grade 4 video. Today uh, our subject is al Ahlaq and it's our second part. So new questions uh, and now without further ado let's get into the video. Okay? Question 1. It is good habit to do blank before Salah. It is good habit to do miswak before Salah. The meaning of miswak means brushing teeth. Two, we should say salam to Muslims. How we say salam? The first person who says salam says assalamu alaikum. To reply to that salam is wa alaikum salam. But, but saying wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh is even better while saying salam. Question 3. We don't get jannah by lying. Lying is a bad habit and that won't give you any good things. Question 4. Who said cleanliness is half of Iman? Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu The Messenger of Allah, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Question 5. What is the symbol of Islam? The symbol of Islam is the crescent and the star. We should keep away from bad friends. Bad friends can do very bad things for us and they could even ruin our lives. Question Subhana Rabbi al Alim is recited in Sujood. Question 8. Begging is not a good habit. Question 9. We should behave well with non Muslims too. We don't think that non Muslims are not Muslims and not that good to them. They too are humans like us and they too should be treated well. Question we should not sit before elders. We should not do it because it's not a respectful thing to do. Question 11. Things that should be followed when drinking water. Take a clean glass of water and fill it with water according to your requirement. You have to take a clean glass otherwise the water would be dirty. And only take it to the amount of water you need. Because sometimes it might be too much and you might and it's not good to spill water or waste it. Recite Bismillah before drinking. Drink with the right hand. Minimum three sips. After drinking water, say Alhamdulillah. Question 12. Explain the way we should treat our visitors. Treat guests generously. <coughs> Shake their hands and say Salam. Just like I said earlier, uh, for guests too, you have to say Salam. Offer them drink or food. Start a conversation. Don't just start any type of conversation. Talk about good things and don't make them uh, don't make them sad. Send them home with a treat. Question 13. What are the beneficial results of speaking the truth? You don't have to remember your lies. You'll earn trust and respect. You'll create deeper connections with people. Lying takes energy. When you lie over and over, it's harder to keep on lying. So it's better to just say the truth at the first moment. Question 14. Acts that should be done by a person with taqwa. A poor trust or, or in Arabic amna. Be faithful or al-wafa. Al be patient. Al-sabr. Have a good life. Question 15. Dua that should be recited when we go to sleep. Allahumma bismika mutu wahya. Which means, Oh Allah, in, in your name I live and die. Question 16. Dua that should be recited in the evening. Am sayna wa am sal ulka lillahi rabbil alameena alameena lahum. 17. Dua that should be recited in the sujood. Subhana Rabbi al-Ala wa bihamdihi. So guys, hope this video was interesting and please subscribe to our video now.